good morning children and welcome back next topic in this chapter human health and diseases is about adolescence and drug and alcohol abuse okay now what is adolescence children you know adolescence is a period of during which a child becomes mature in terms of his or her attitudes and beliefs okay so it is a bridge between childhood and adulthood that is between 12 to 18 years of age that's why it is called as teen age right and it is a very vulnerable age where there is many many mental and physiological psychological changes or development in your body taking place okay now what are the reasons for adolescents taking into drug or alcohol abuse children yeah it is mainly because of curiosity first and foremost ke okay, um, reason is curiosity and experimentation it is they just would, would like to try we just try and see we may not take another time we just once one time they think and take it okay that is curiosity and experimentation need for adventure and excitement the third main main thing is to escape from their problems they face with lot of problems right they have many mental you just now you you saw that it's, it's an age of mental and psychological development okay so they have to face many problems they have their own uh, thinking their own identity and because of that they they cannot adjust with the even in their households okay so to escape from the problems they take to drug or alcohol okay then uh, the stress from peer or peer pressure to excel in academics or examination that is not only from peer even from the house from parents uh, or okay peers also to excel in they in academics or examination they, they are expected to perform beyond their level okay so to escape from all that they just taken to drug or alcohol abuse then there is um, inspiration from television movies newspapers and internet etc and uh, the foremost we can say this is because of unstable and unsupportive family structures and peer pressure nowadays lot lot of uh, uh, there uh, things are going around uh, isn't it of people taking drugs and drug abuse the people of the cine field so, so no right now if they take it once they feel like take it again taking it again and thus they become addicted now what is addiction and what is also they become completely dependent on this particular drug or alcohol okay now what is addiction children addiction is a psychological attachment or euphoria and a temporary feeling of well-being the feeling of well-being is only temporary when they take the drug they feel euphoria and excitement or whatever it is but that is all temporary okay but they want the temporary feeling so it's a psychological attachment okay now with repeated use of drugs the tolerance levels of the receptor increases now continuously they are taking these drugs so with the, with that continuous repeated use they the tolerance level becomes high thus the receptors respond only to higher doses leading to greater intake and it becomes addiction okay now what is dependence now the tendency of the body to manifest a characteristic and unpleasant withdrawal syndrome if regular dose of drugs or alcohol is abruptly discontinued so they have completely now become addicted or completely dependent on the drugs or the alcohol now when they don't get even the dose the particular dose even or uh, 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 once their body shows certain symptoms like uh, shaking as their hands and uh, hands of the thing shake they become uh, anxious anxiety 
they become nauseated uh, sweating this okay aggressive behavior all this they show and also these are the called the withdrawal symptoms withdrawal symptoms okay now dependence leads to also leads to social adjustment problems uh, when they become completely addicted or dependent on these drug this particular drug or alcohol they even their behavior changes everything about them changes right what are the other effects of this drug abuse and alcohol abuse that is they show reckless behavior reckless behavior vandalism violence they uh, they take to violence activities violent activities right sometimes they may cause even if this drug is mixed with the uh, alcohol or the normal drug they they may be taking some other regular drugs right if they take along with that they, that may lead to death also it may cause heart failure and cerebral hemorrhage and respiratory failure breathing failure and they may die okay when they when they take this mix mixella with when they take this um, drug with the usual uh, usual drug okay and uh, continuous use of these drugs may damage the nervous system and also causes especially the alcohol alcohol intake leads to liver cirrhosis that is fattening of the liver and drying of the liver which is called as liver cirrhosis okay and uh, it is a mental and social distress to the family and friends you know that okay and uh, uh, social uh, problems like stealing why stealing children these drugs are all very costly things costly items for to buy these things to call, to get continuous supply of these things and they have, they they are not earning at all they are still a teenage a boy or a girl right and they need money for all these things to buy these things and they opt for stealing or uh, theft also theft and all all that and also you know that how do these drug drug abusers it intake these things these drugs they sit in gangs they sit in groups and they intake they may take as oral injection or uh, injection uh, using the same syringe and if one of the persons may uh, have aids or any other sexually transmitted diseases that will get that will transmit to all the people in that gang okay then also uh, it has spread of infectious disease like aids and hepatitis other uh, effects are loss of sexual drive and also necrospermia what do you mean by necrospermia which means death of the sperms sperms may not be produced or the, when the sperms are produced if the sperms are produced they may die okay and use of drugs and alcohol by pregnant women may affect the fetus also which is called as fas which is fetal alcoholic syndrome okay if the female or the mother who is pregnant takes the alcohol uh, it will it will affect the fetus which is called as fas okay and misuse of drugs by athletes example uh, which are the drugs taken by these athletes like narcotic analgesics anabolic steroids steroids are the main thing steroids diuretics and certain hormones to increase their why they take these children to increase their muscle strength and bulk and to promote aggressiveness and uh, finally uh, increase their performance level in their sports or athletes okay right now how can one know that that whether the teenage the child the girl or boy is is uh, is using drugs or alcohol but definitely we we just now discussed it will affect their mental physical physiological psychological uh, in all all aspects of the individual right so there is there will be a drop in the academic performance the marks will be if they are, if if he or she the child is a very good at studies or the performance will go down and the, the, he will be absent from school 
now and often they are absent from school lack of interest in personal hygiene withdrawal isolation they they, uh, they they do not uh, talk with friends they always secluded they are always uh, alone right and uh, they show depression they always tired they very aggressive aggressive kind of behavior and rebellious behavior okay and also they have change in the sleeping and eating habits also and there will be fluctuations in their weight and appetite fluctuation mean there may be drop or increase in weight okay lack of interest in hobbies whatever hobbies they used to do, do before now they do not they don't be doing they always thinking of this alcohol or drug okay deteriorism deteriorating relationship between the family and friends family and friends right okay now what are the side effects of taking or in taking anabolic steroids which are usually taken by these athletics sports persons right often they are banned from sports for five uh, for, okay five nearly five years uh if they are found taking or abusing these kinds of drugs anabolic steroids okay now what are the side effects especially acne see in the pictures you can see this acne increased aggressiveness mood swings at some time they may be happy sometime they may be depressed okay reduced testicles that is reduction in the size of the testes okay and decreased sperm production kidney and liver dysfunction breast enlargement what do you call this condition as gynecomastia isn't it premature baldness enlargement of prostate gland masculinization that is becoming if females female athletes uh, if they use this alcohol i mean anabolic steroids they tend to become more male like having strong features and all and uh, uh, slowly turning themselves or becoming into males right masculinization increased aggressiveness mood swings and depressions excessive hair on face and body excessive hair on body and face abnormal menstrual cycle deepening of voice all our men this one changing into male like features right deepening of voice enlargement of clitoris clitoris okay this is in the case of males and this is in the case of females right okay so these are the side effects of taking anabolic steroid there are many instances of uh, uh, females becoming into male uh, long back in the olympics and all every country want to prove their athletes right okay they want to uh, be the first in that sports so they they tend to use they uh, make them take these steroids and many many have become male like females have become male like in male like right the other side effects of uh, of taking anabolic steroids are children uh, severe facial and body acne this one body acne and also premature closure of the growth centers of long bones growth centers of long bones and resulting in stunted growth okay now how to prevent or how to control this uh, drug abuse or alcohol abuse to avoid undue peer pressure peer pressure means not giving excess pressure to perform better to perform extra or to perform more okay with educating and counseling first uh, first uh, analyzing who is uh, uh, drug abused uh, who is taking drug and they are given proper education proper counseling is given to them and uh, help from parents and peers 
looking for danger signs whatever signs no we just read for for the drug abuse for if they if any person or child shows teenage shows such a signs we can definitely conclude that that person is uh, into drug abuse or alcohol abuse right so seeking professional and medical help such as psychologists and psychiatrists then d addiction that is medication to uh, to bring them to to de addict and also rehabilitation programs okay thank you children that's all with the lesson